When I arrived at Holy Trinity High School, there were two sets of sisters that worked at Holy Trinity, the Mercy Sisters and the Dominican Sisters. The Sisters of Mercy were the founders, founding sisters of Holy Trinity High School. Sister Nora Duty was the chairperson of the English department when I was at Holy Trinity High School. She was a wonderful mentor and helped me grow into the person that I am today. The Sisters of Mercy taught me at St. Teresa of Lisieux in Brooklyn. So meeting them at Holy Trinity, it was as if I was coming home. In particular, Sister Peggy Casey, Sister Consuela, and Sister Celine affected my life tremendously. They helped me every step along the way, and they also helped me to grow in my faith life and to show what's important in helping others. I think I had a very good relationship with the sisters. We had our tough times because I had my philosophy of education uh, function and focusing on freedom, and they had their philosophy of education, which was a little bit different. Okay? Uh, but I, my relationship with the sisters was very good. I maintained contact with them after I left. Okay? In particular, I maintained a very close contact with one of the assistant principals, okay? Sister Marie Kennedy, uh, who has died quite a while ago now. Okay? Uh, but uh, they were very supportive, okay? even though we had our difficulties. Okay? But most of the, for mostly the relationship was a very, very good relationship, very healthy relationship. And mutual respect was uh, governed the way we dealt with one another. When I think of the sisters here, I just, I want to smile and just uh, look back at how they managed the school, how they were the silent voice of respect. Um, sisters like Sister John Rose, Sister Teresa Angel, Sister Paula, um, Sister Margie, uh, just mean the world to me and continue to mean the world to me. Uh, the sisters were a daily reminder. Um, back in the day when we were here, um, they had their habits and a full habit. And then also while we were here, they changed and went into late clothes. And uh, I remember the shock walking down the hall of um, seeing some of the outfits that the sisters were wearing. But they were a daily reminder. We would see them at mass um, in the morning and after school. The sisters had a great effect uh, on my life. They taught me discipline, they taught me fortitude, uh, they taught me uh, how to fail and then succeed, and trust me, I failed several courses uh, at Trinity. They taught me how to work uh, well with others. They were integral and important to my life at Trinity and my life after. The sisters affected my time here at Holy Trinity in many different interesting ways. I have to admit with you, in my freshman and sophomore years, there was a lot more discipline that was going on than there probably is today. But for that token, I probably needed a little bit more discipline at that point than I need today also. But I think what they also showed is that there's a great balance between discipline and love and also being in a great Christian environment. I loved the sisters. I loved it. We had the blacks and the whites, we had the Dominicans and the Mercies, we had the two convents, and it was a great lesson in respect, but there was a kindness from those sisters. And what a sacrifice. They sacrificed their lives for us. They really did. They didn't have their own families or their own children, but they had thousands of children who they sacrificed for during the course of their lives. And I can't thank them enough.